everyone welcome to my Dollar Tree haul and I have some lots of stationery some beauty and some decor and other things also so I'm just gonna start with like the beauty kind of stuff because I know that a lot of people like beauty I don't have that much and I don't I guess it's considered beauty but I got this one this is the profusion and it's I guess the dupe for baby lips and this is in the color grape and I'm going to swatch it I kind of wanted like I don't have any purple colors really and I'm kind of getting into color lipstick so that is what it looks like it smells like grapes let's do a swatch and see um there's a no color <laughs> payoff that i can see and maybe a slight tint so i guess this is some more for moisturizing as you can see no color payoff okay and these are just this is just like a chapstick or lip balm and it's the Laffy Taffy Watermelon. That sounded nice to me and look at the cute packaging. And it's, I don't have any, water, I love watermelon scented. I love a watermelon to eat. That's like my favorite fruit and it's green as you can see. Mm. It does smell like watermelon. I don't think these um, lip balms or whatever are like the most moisturizing really. They are kind of a weird consistency I feel like on my lips. But I wanted that one for the watermelon scent and it's kind of, I guess it is like a watermelon Laffy Taffy scent. So that makes sense. Okay, these are the Global Beauty Care Retinol Cleansing Wipes, Cleansing Cloths. So I got those. I got some Hawaiian Hawaiian tropical fruit bubble gum. So you get banana, pineapple, lime, mango, and coconut. So the banana and coconut really is the reason why I wanted to try this. I love double bubble. I love a gum a lot. Okay, I think I will go with decor next. And then I'll be stationary. Um, this is just a wild decal. I've done a lot of these in my new home. So this one just says a family where life begins and love never ends. And where I'm going to use this is I'm going to put this on the wall where I put my family portraits. I'm in the process. I want to update my pictures and this is what it looks like how you can use it to decorate you can do it like that with like a shelf and some vases or vases however you pronounce it or you can be like i'm going to do i'm going to put this on my family wall you know where you have like the collages of your family i'm going to stick this one on there i think that would be nice and i have the chalkboard labels i don't have any chalk or any markers i do have the labels that i got ages ago from Dollar Tree. So I got the, the markers. I've heard good things about these so far. So I got the one in white, classic white, and I got the one in yellow because my station is sunflowers. So I thought yellow and white would be nice. Kind of go with my kitchen. And then I got, oh, I got this. I do have the these are called wine glass shades and you use like the tea light, the electric tea light candles. I'm sure you could use a regular tea light candle, but I think it would be safer to use the, you know, the battery operated tea light candles. And this is good for party decorations, table settings, centerpieces, night lights. And I thought this was a nice um, kind of neutral color. It kind of goes with my furniture and things that I want to put in the living room. I have no lighting in the living room. And this would also be in like a, a classy kind of bathroom, bathroom nightlight, I think. And all you need to do is I have two large size wine glasses already. And I do have the tea light candle, the battery operated tea light candles. 
and all you do is just you mold shape to this like that and it lock it says it has easy lock tabs and then you put it over your wine glass and I thought the gold and silver one was really nice and there's the design okay and I'll just show this this is the Lysol disinfectant wipes. It's always going to have these to, you know, when germs go around, you can wipe your um, light switches, your remote controls, doorknobs, you know, that's all good. I mean, you could probably use the, I kind of use these kind of things like for that. I don't use these for cleaning. I rather use, you, you know, I like to use a spray or just soap and water to clean with and these are more like a spot clean and like you know to get the germ get the germs away especially since those are they kill the flu virus and they are 99.9 percent .9 you know disinfecting okay now let's get to the stationery because of course i got things that i do not need <laughs> And I do not ever need to buy any more notebooks or pens. And when you move, you realize, like, how much you have. And hopefully I can fit these in the drawer where my notebooks are. I have a drawer full of journals and notebooks. I do not need any more. And I do not need any more pens or pencils either. Like, I do need to buy some pencils for my son. But, like, for me, you know, the girly pens and pencils no more I don't need any more of those but I did get washi tape and this is the like birthday I think design is with the balloons so that is the reason why I got this so there you go because I didn't have any like birthday washi stuff so that's why I got that these are like denim denim I don't think I think they're paper not fabric um they're decorative decorative poster stickers and i thought these would be nice for scrapbooking and even if my son has a project we could use these because they are um denim and you know boys can use their blue and their denim or i can use it for scrapbooking one more i got the fish stickers and these are clownfish I believe and then there's a few starfish and I thought these would be nice because I live at the beach and you know I've ta we've taken a lots of pictures of the beach. I do have some pictures pinned that I would love to take at the beach though on Pinterest. Okay I have three journals that I did not need and but I could not resist them because I love, this one has a bird on it, and I love birds, and I start, I'm sorry for that glare. It's kind of like this, um, I don't know what this, it looks like craft paper kind of, I think that's what it's called. And then the, over here is like the design with the bird on it and flowers. So, I couldn't resist that because I love birds. And then this is the flor a floral one. And I've used um, a notebook like this before. And it's just like skin long and skinny. And this is like the perfect one for grocery list, I think. Art list making. And that's usually, I do a lot of list making. And this is another one that I bought. It is the... Um, I think this will be good for your purse since it snaps closed and, you know, it won't, like, open up in your purse and all your paper gets squ squished together. But did I need these? No. I do not need those. I got some of these. Um, they're self-stick flags. So, I got some of those. And I apologize for the glare. It's pretty colors, like pink and orange yellow, green, blue, um, purple, yep, really nice, beautiful, vibrant colors, and you can use them to mark pages in a book, or if you want to do a recipe, in a, rec in a cookbook, you can mark your page so that you can go back to it, and you know, and you can probably write on those, like, what recipe it is, I do that a lot with 
sticky notes like those. Um, you could probably put them in your planner to mark. If you don't, I use like a clip, a paper clip, a binder clip, I think it's called, to and just binder, just clip like my month. But you could use those in planners, of course. I got the ballpoint pens that I did not need because I want to do what everyone else has been doing and put, do the washi tape in the pen. And I think Cha Cha Cakes, she did, she was inspired by someone maybe on Pinterest or Instagram, but she is the first one that I that I saw do this video. And there is another lady, her name is Jamie, and I don't know her channel, like, to say it, but I can link her channel below. Both of those lovely ladies did this craft where you put the washi tape in the pen, and they can, if you watch their video on it, I will link their video below. And then you can, you know, get through and get to their channel and subscribe to them if you're not already subscribed to them. So I got those pins to do that. I guess there's always exceptions, right? And this one is for tweens and teens, probably. This is the Fashion Friends Activity Sticker Book. And the reason why I got this is because some of these stickers, is that is the reason why I got it. But this is kind of cool if you have like a tween girl or even, you know, like a middle school girl or even an elementary school girl. I don't know what the age group on this is, but they can do all types of fun things in this book. There is a cute girly um, word find. And there's a word puzzle or word search. Wait a minute. What is this called? Crossword puzzle. I like the word finds better myself. Um, I guess they could color. I'm going to show you the reason why I bought this book because I'm mazes. My son used to love to do these all the time when he was a little younger. The reason why I bought this is because it has these stickers. So, you know, these are awesome for even your planner, scrapbooking, whatever you want to do. I love these hats and the beach ball and the sunglasses and the starfish and the fish, lipsticks, nail polish, mascaras. There's a little owl and a little teddy bear. And, you know, strawberries, cookies, sprinkles, bags, purses boots these are awesome to stick anywhere this is another little cute thing for a girl today this is just a cute book i'm looking to see if there's anything else interesting to show you guys There's some more. These are not stickers, but you could probably cut them out and glue them into something. And, of course, you could give this to a little girl. I don't have a little girl, but I have little girl, like little girls. I knew no little girls I could give this to. And then, look, there's a connect the dots. Something really cute if you have it young girls too or if you're like me and you just want those stickers that's the reason why i got it this book okay two more things this is a white sanding block i did like two manicures myself and i love to do my own manicures like when i go to get my nails done and get manicures and pedicures done i just get like the boring french manicure i just like it when i go get it professionally done i just like that but when I'm at home and doing them myself, I just love to do, you know, cool things. Like Pinterest inspired, YouTube inspired, Instagram inspired looks. But my nails got ruined because I did like two um, Q 
cute nail looks or whatever and then my nails started like peeling and it probably did not help um you know moving with packing and unpacking and all that the boxes the newspaper the bubble wrap all that stuff the tape begun you know the just the cardboard will tear your nails up so i am like the starting from scratch as you can tell but i got this because my nails were like peeling i don't know if it's the nail polish or the nail polish remover that is like damaging my nails but it just you know it breaks my nails and just damages them i don't know so i got this before i just cut them all off and if they grow back and they're still like peeling i'm gonna try this and see if i can buff them and see if that can help i don't know then i got some toothbrushes it's always good to have toothbrushes and that is oops i do have one more thing I got a hand soap and this is the Clara and Danver which is a good hand soap and this is the Ocean Fresh scent and isn't that cute with a little ocean theme and I'm gonna smell it and kind of describe it hmm it doesn't really smell like you would think an o the o like the ocean scent is kind of a I don't know kind of fresh kind of fruity a little bit as odd as that is but it smells really good it's like a fresh scent and that is everything i got from dollar tree hope you guys enjoyed thank you so much for watching bye